My car tells me when I'm gonna hit a wall now. Like, we need this. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Thanks for hanging out with us. I'm Brian Tong. And I'm I Justine, and we're so excited to talk about the best of CES of vehicle tech. Some of, because there's been so much throughout the years. By land, sea, or sky, tech is on the move with no signs of slowing down anytime soon. CES 2023 was the largest gathering of vehicle tech in the history of the show, from electric bikes to Caterpillar trucks, CES has proven that they are a devoted home for innovative vehicle tech. Announcements made at CES prove that the sky is no longer the limit. I see what you did there, Justine. Now, exciting vehicle announcements are always on the horizon at CES, but let's relive just some of those CES vehicle tech moments that truly hit the ground running, or I guess driving, flying? Today, it feels like the obvious next step in vehicle innovation is automation, but there was a time when that wasn't the case. And when companies announced their progress in the world of automated vehicles, they turned to the CES stage. In 2014, BMW demonstrated the BMW i3 at CES, a car that can park itself and be called to pick someone up all from just a smartwatch. The car also offered a 360 degree view and advanced driver safety systems. Hey Justine, isn't this crazy how we take these features for granted now? My car tells me when I'm gonna hit a wall now, like we need this. <laughs> CES audiences knew what it meant for such a state of the art vehicle to be hitting the market. And within the next few years, vehicles with automated features started to hit production and then roads across America. Vehicle tech is not limited to roads, four wheels, or even the ground. CES has seen some spectacular innovations in air travel, including we've got Bell's announcement in 2019 about Nexus air travel, where in partnership with Uber, they revealed a design for the world's first aerial ride shares. Uber predicted the Nexus to be less expensive than owning a car, with costs that were comparable to car ride sharing rates. Now this announcement changed the way that people thought about their commute in urban areas because the next year, Hyundai and Uber took the concept just another step further with a full-scale air taxi concept model, the SA1 right on the showroom floor. And this enormous air taxi model was roughly the size of a basketball court. In 2022, Sierra Space presented a replica of their dream chaser space plane that is intended to take people into low Earth orbit. Also aboard the 30-foot craft is a giant inflatable house for moon inhabitants. Is, is that like a jump house? I don't know. I'd like that too. I'm into it. <laughs> <laughs> now, Sierra Space and countless other companies that come to CES continue to impress the crowds and set the tone for future innovation. And sometimes innovation happens when humans just want to make something super cool. Furion's new Marine 78 Adonis is so cool, and it was the first yacht ever on display at CES, and it certainly created waves at the show. It was decked out with artificial intelligence, facial recognition, and the ability to deploy photo-taking drones. I got a chance to check this out in 2019, and it was so awesome. That thing looked crazy wild, and with a yacht that can learn a boater's preference and then suggest activities or restaurants, why would you ever want to dock? And in 2023, BMW elevated what it means to have a customized driver experience with a concept car iVision D. With this car, the driver can quickly switch between or combine 32 colors on the body surface of the car. This was my favorite thing ever. CES is where vehicle tech navigates the future, and on the show floor, you can witness the boldest breakthroughs. You can count on CES to capture the industry's most epic moments. So, Ooh. how about that yacht? How about that? How about that how, yacht? How about the yacht we're gonna see this year? Do you think that maybe we should do an unboxing of it? Like, I mean, I'll totally do it. <laughs> uh, un unyoxine? Unyoxine? I'll un do that. Okay, that's a new term. We're ready, 2024, we, it's we here. We made it, <laughs> we did it. We might need a drone for this one.